So Jose, uh, bright blue BMW i3, I mean, who is, who's the buyer for something like this? There's a lot of buyers out there, actually. Uh, about 90% of Americans drive less than 33 miles a day. Uh, this car has 114 miles E-range, so if there's a lot of Americans that could be driving this car. You know, I have not seen one of these on the market. I'm in New York City. Uh, where are these hot? Where are these selling really well right now? Well, they're amazingly strong uh, in a lot of areas, especially in the mega cities or the, the metropolitan areas, but uh, also the suburban areas, yeah. uh, especially, of course, California, mm -hmm. extremely strong there. In the East Coast here in uh, New York Metro, New Jersey, uh, these are also strong. So you'd be surprised to see uh, these i3s seen here in the protonic blue, as you said. Yeah. Uh, very nice, it, and it, it stands out. Is it because of the electric? Is that, is that, what, is that the draw? in some of these markets? Well, it's not just the electric and the infrastructure, of course, that, that goes along with it, but it also, I think, is a customer and consumer mindset. Gotcha. People are ready for the next evolution in, in automobiles and technology, sure. and this is just the next step. Well, let's get in. Let's, let's right. check this thing out. Sure. So this is the charging station, actually, that goes in your house. Yes. Wow. Pretty. Whoa. Pretty. So the door actually opens out that way. Yeah, you, you know, can family see. Family friendly here. Hop on in. We'll, exactly. Yeah. Wow, interesting. So it's very, it's very minimal in here. There's no. It feels like it's missing something. I don't know what it is, but it's minimal. It's missing the transmission tunnel. There we go. It's, it's since it's all electric, we have the electric motors in the rear, mm -hmm. right? BMW DNA, rear wheel yeah. drive. Um, but we have this kind of loft appeal. Mm -hmm. So it's, uh, we really were able to design a, from the interior from the clean sheet because. The whole vehicle, the whole life module, as we call it, uh, where the passenger compartment is, we wanted to design something that's functional for living in the city. Yeah. So well, it has for, a lot of supports. I mean, it has connections. And... It has the technology, but yeah. think about it. If you're in the street and there's cars coming on this side, mm -hmm. you can actually enter from the passenger side and just slip through the driver's side huh. because you have no transmission tunnel. Sure. Um, but the car is functionally uh, purposely built that way. Uh, so there's a lot of these tricks and features that uh, really appeal to it. What is the key technology? You know, we've noticed walking around the BMW, we've talked to you guys before, autonomous driving is a big function. Does this car have that? This has a lot of the safety uh, and innovation features, uh, like uh, driving assistance as well. But I think when we talk about designing a vehicle, even in its conception, we already thought about doing that very sustainably, right? There's no requirement to do that. The carbon fiber, the, the energy, the most energy intensive process uh, of this whole car, it's actually being uh, powered by hydroelectric power. The seats, it's made from recycled plastics and peanut fibers on the door. Um, so this is a, rec a recyclable car. It, it has a lot of features that make it authentic, but it's not in your face saying, that's hey, look at me selling green. points too, you think, about It is. And it's, it's from a consumer mindset, people are already asking about, hey, how can I have a, a, a wood trim that's sustainably focused, sure. right? That it's not uh, using just all these lacquers that are uh, harmful for the environment. Um, but the whole car and the whole concept, even the, the, the passenger cell that was made from carbon fiber, uh, so carbon fiber reinforced plastics, um, it's F1 technology today. Unbelievable. Well, I'm going to have to consider giving him up my gas guzzler. Thank you. I appreciate the time. No problem. Thank you.